So did hell freeze over or what? I never thought I would live to see the day that Apple announces that RCS support is coming to iPhone next year, 2024. Now, this is great. Aside from the arguments of the blue and green bubble, this is absolutely great. Where Android users that have friends that are Apple users and vice versa are able to send messages, photos, videos in a much better way with encryption, which is great. So it talks about it, and in a surprising move, Apple's announced today that it will adopt the RCS Rich Communication Services Messaging Standard. The feature will launch via software update later next year and bring a wide range of iMessage style features to the messaging between iPhone and Android users. So that's pretty awesome. And here's the official statement from Apple. Later next year, we will be adding support for RCS Profile, the standard as currently published by the GSM Association. We believe RCS Universal Profile will offer a better inoperability experience, which compared to SMS or MMS. This will work alongside iMessage, which will continue to be the best and most secure messaging experience for Apple users. So it may be adding a little bit more into iMessage to, you know, for like Apple users to have some benefits of staying using iMessage, but no longer will it default to SMS if you're texting an Android user. It will now use RCS. And if those are wondering, is that going to change the green bubble to a different bubble color? Who knows? They may still keep it the green bubble so you know it's Android. I mean, green is synonymous with Android. But never mind the color bubbles because that's irrelevant. The big key thing here is that uh, we will have a better messaging between Android and iOS.